Hi there. Today I'm going to show you how to make one of these great little uh, origami uh, decorations. This one's a uh, star, and they look great up against a uh, up against a window. Okay, so all we need to make one is we start off with an A4 piece of paper, and we need a square. So obviously, an A4 piece of paper is a rectangle. So we need to make a square. So we just fold over that edge over to the other side, and line it up that edge along the other edge, and Fold that in a uh, diagonal, and I'm going to cut along uh, that edge there, and this little, uh, we just cut along that edge there. Now, very careful when you're working with scissors that you don't cut yourself or hurt yourself in any way. And there we go. So that that little bit of paper is uh, spare, so I'll put that to one side, and there we go. We're left with a square. Okay so there we have we've got a square of paper and we've got one one diagonal fold down the middle and we'll make another diagonal fold uh, through the other diagonal putting that uh, corner piece there across to the other corner and flatten that out. Oops. Yep and now what we're going to do is We'll spin that over, and we're going to fold this side across to match up with the other side. Yep, and then we'll fold that. Yep, this the other through the other uh, sides, that side across to that side, like so. Okay, so the way I've done it now is I've the diagonals are folded in that way, and then these uh, rectangular lines are actually folded the other way. So I've got both those going the other way, and the diagonals going upwards. And if you haven't done it that way, just fold it over so you've you've got it. And now what we're going to do is grab those uh, t two opposite pieces there and sort of push it together like that. And you'll come up with a bit of a diamond shape, and you can see there in the middle, you've got that sort of a uh, concertina shape. And now all we need to do is fold that over, down that uh, diagonal line you've already got there, fold it over. Yep. And what we want to make sure is the top there, the top one, we've got one, two, three, four of those folded lines and down the bottom here you know well if you could open up up you've got eight bits of paper there so the, the eight bits go down below and the four folds go up the top and then all we need to do is fold that across like that so that side lines up with there we've made a fold and now we need to get our scissors again We will just cut along that uh, folded line. Yep, those little bits we can put those to one side, and we're left with uh, that piece now. And now what we're going to do is make three cuts, um, parallel cuts, and they're probably in about a centimetre, and they don't quite go all the way there. So, if you're having trouble with the with the scissors, you might uh, need to ask an adult. I guess if you're if you're a kid, you might need to ask an adult to help you with the with the cutting. So we have three cuts, and they're running parallel with that line there. So we've made one, and we've made two. Yep, and they finish about oh one and a half centimeters, maybe three quarters of an inch down from that other side. And obviously, as you go up, they're going to be a shorter cut. Yep, that's it. And now we just open it up. And see what we're left with. So there we go, there's our star shape we're left with. And if we get that little piece there, and fold it down like that, and leave that middle one there, but then get the other piece, and fold it down there like that, we're starting to get our, our shape and do that the same thing on all four corners.
and again. So it's the main big piece and then the last little piece, fold them over. There we go. And there we go. There's our decoration finished. All we need to do is that is uh, put it on a window and enjoy.